Hi, I'm Karen McTavish, APQS representative. Um, I've been with uh, APQS for 25 years. I have to say, I have not yet met a confident quilter. Let's talk about confident. I'm not confident. All I know is that I might know a little bit more about quilting than the average guy in the street. So what you have to do is just fight the fear. Um, when somebody brings me a quilt to quilt, the first thing they say is don't look at the points. Don't look at this, don't look at that. We all feel that way and that is our lack of confidence. So truly people are not looking at your points. We're looking at the overall impact of your quilt. We're looking at um, the, the texture of your quilting. We're looking at the overall impact. We're not looking at points, I swear. Long armors are not looking at your points. What we need to focus on is how can we make your quilt comfortable, warm, beautiful, and last for 50 years. Don't we want all of our quilts to last forever? So the thing is, is that you, it, do you, do you uh, read magazines, quilt magazines? Are you part of Instagram and that quilting community? Um, you probably know what, what good quilting looks like. And then that whole thing about practice, practice, practice. The great thing about Quilt Path um, computerized quilting is the learning curve is like a week and it's perfect. If you want perfect, Quilt Path is the way to go because it will achieve perfect quilting. Now ruler work, free motion work, all that, that takes practice. Just like if you're drawing on a piece of paper during a, a boring meeting, um, what you're doing is creating that muscle memory. So the more you are drawing on the piece of paper, it's just the same thing. And it generally looks a lot better on the quilt than it does on the paper. So what I'd like you to do is fight through the fear and I've had a motto since I started in 1997. Do the hardest thing, never take a shortcut, and try to do what hand quilters do. And what I mean by that, hand quilters could take 30,000 hours hand quilting a quilt. So it's okay if you spend some time machine quilting your quilt. So what you want to do is have fun. I mean, literally, wake up in the morning and get excited about coming out to your machine and quilting all day. That's what I love.